I'm in heaven. This is heaven. Heaven Buddha Park. So this temple section is all about heaven up the top and hell down the bottom. So as you enter, you go into hell and you see all the spirits and demons and things, different complexes, which I will show you. And then you keep going up these really narrow stairs, uh, steep stairs up to the top like here. And this is heaven and it looks pretty cool. Apparently, my friend told me, uh, the person who built this, built this Buddha park here in Laos, but then just across the Mekong in Thailand, they built a very, very similar style in Thailand. So there's two Buddha parks, one in Laos and one in Thailand, in Nong Khai, I guess that is. So there you go. So this is Buddha Park in Vientiane, Laos. To enter, you go through this demon's mouth into hell and then work your way up to heaven. All right, so this is hell. This is the bottom section. Some sections, there are what? One, two, three, I think there's four sections. This one bottom, then two middle, and then the top with the roof. But this one, and I think the second top one, you can only enter from the center section. There's only a center section uh, stairwell. Others you can enter from the side, but so it's pretty hard to uh, go up and down these stairs. I'm sweating so much. So this is the bottom level. This is hell. And you can tell from the some of the figures, like this one here, the spirits hanging off the tree. This one dead. Yeah, this is hell. It is so hot in here. Oh, jeez. I found the park really interesting. There are so many different sculptures and statues here. And it's not like your typical temple where you might go and see a number of Buddha statues, but they're all in the same kind of position or pose. Here, it's a really creative way. Um, it really gets your imagination and your attention because some have four heads, some are attacking others. It's a really different slant or view on Buddhism and Hinduism. Uh, and the Buddha statues. Um, while you're walking through, there are some flowers and other gardens uh, where you can see lots of butterflies, even some golden lotus. Golden lotus. Is it golden lotus? Oh uh, yeah, golden lotus. But overall, the park is really interesting. I spent about 30 minutes here, but the thing is, I sweated the most here than I've ever sweated in Laos. It is so hot and humid here, it's unbelievable. Sweat was literally dripping off my hands and my GoPro crashed at one stage because it was so hot and humid. So yeah, beware of that, bring lots of water, but otherwise you'll spend quite a bit of time here. It's a really interesting park.